everybody, I am Baseball Boy, and I'm back and playing more Pokemon Crystal version for the Game Boy Color. So, in the last video recording session, everybody, you all saw we were exploring more of Goldenrod City, and also I explored more of Blackthorn City, and I also took on the gym in Blackthorn City and got my 8th gym badge in the game. So now in this video recording session, everybody, we're going to continue exploring more of Eurotique City, Mount Mortar, and hopefully get to the Pokemon League. So without further ado, let the Pokemon Crystal Version Adventures and Pokemon Battles begin. Ah, base gamer, I just finished your ball here. That turned out great. Try catching Pokemon with it. You have an Apricorn for me? Fine, I'll turn it into a ball. Which Apricorn should I use? It'll take a day to make you a ball. I'll come back for it later. Hi, base gamer. Thanks to you, my research is going great. Take this as a token of my appreciation. The Master Ball is the best. It's the ultimate ball that will catch any Pokemon without fail. It's given only to recognized Pokemon's researchers. I think you can make much better use of it than I can, base gamer. A momentous event has occurred. I beg your pardon, but I must ask you two to leave. Ah, the sound of that clear bell. It is sublime. I've never heard so beautiful a sound before. That bell chime is indicative of the bearer's soul. You, you may be able to make it through Tin Tower. Please do go on. Legends has it that upon the emergence of a trainer who has the ability to touch the souls of Pokemon, a Pokemon will come forth to put that trainer to test at the Tin Tower. The legend has come true. The legendary Pokemon Suicune has arrived. We, the wise trio, shall test your worthiness to go inside.
stronger than we thought, perhaps? Ah, so it is you who claim to have seen Suikunente and Rako while they slept. Unbelievable. Legend has it that they can't be seen while, they're, while they sleep. Can you be trusted with the truth? I must ascern in your worthiness. I will tell you the truth. In the past, there were two nine-tier towers here. The Brass Tower, which was said to awaken Pokemon, and the Tin Tower, where Pokemon were set to rest. The view from the tops of the towers must have been magnificent. At the time, an immense silver-colored Pokemon was said to make its roots atop the Brass Tower. However, about 150 years ago, a lightning bolt struck one of the towers. It was engulfed in flames that ranged for three days. A sudden downpour finally put out the blaze. And that is how the burned tower came to be. Let me see your power.
Too strong, why? You, are you the trainer who is awaited by the legendary Pokemon? I see. We, the Wise Trio, have been given the responsibility of protecting the legendary Pokemon. We are to allow passage only to those people who possess the power and soul true. Please, do go on and enter the Tin Tower Head. Suicune will put you to the test.
Awesome, too awesome, even. I never seen a battle that great. That was truly inspiring to see. Suicune was tough, but you were even more incredible, base gamer. I heard Suicune's mystic power summons a rainbow-colored Pokemon. Maybe just maybe what went on today will cause that Pokemon to appear. I'm going to study the legends more. Thanks for showing me that fantastic battle. Later, base gamer. When the brass tower burned down, three nameless Pokemon were said to have per perished. It was tragic. However, a rainbow-colored Pokemon. In other worlds, Ho-Ho descended from the sky and gave new life to the three Pokemon. They are Suicune, Entei, and Rakko. That is what they say. According to legend, when the souls of Pokemon and humans commune from the heavens descended a Pokemon rainbow color, could it mean the legendary Pokemon are testing us humans? The two towers are said to have been built to foster friendship and hope between Pokemon and people. That was 700 years ago, but the ideal still remains important today.
I came to explore Mount Marta, but I got separated from my partner. Did you run into a trainer who uses a Cedra that knows waterfall?
Um, oh yes, I'm the move dealer. I can make Pokemon forget moves. Shall I make a Pokemon forget? Which Pokemon? Which move should it forget then? Oh, make it forget cut? Done, your Pokemon forgot the move. 